Hello everybody, my name is Kwasi Mensa. This video demos the Reactive Streams Injection Library. This is a new Java library in DB21C release. The purpose of the library is to allow you to perform high-speed injection of streaming data. And here's the demo platform. On the right, the autonomous database. In the middle, a microservice deployed on the Oracle Kubernetes cluster. The microservice is built using the Helidon framework. It has a tiny REST server and can receive REST calls. We highlighted the accept REST endpoint. The microservice is using the reactive streams ingestion library, you can see. And on the left, we have Gmeter that we will use to generate load. And here is the microservice code. It implements the Java Util Concurrent Publisher interface. The library implements the Java Util Concurrent Flow Subscriber interface. The code configures database connectivity, then declares two publisher objects that will insert data into the database. The service is listening at some endpoint for REST calls, including accept, list, truncate, etc. During the demo, we will be showing some of those. Here is the table we will be using for the insert. We are going to clean up the table, truncate the table to remove leftover from previous invocation. And now we will now use the curl command to manually insert rows in the table. So for that, we need the IP address where the service is listening. So I invite you to observe the latency, the short latency, how fast the rest, the, the curl command returns. And the reason is the library buffers the rows and return to the invoker uh, then asynchronously uses a different thread pool for performing the direct path. Okay, now we will look at the rows uh, being inserted. Uh, you can see that uh, a few commands have inserted a uh, few rows uh, very quickly. Okay, now we're going to use gmeter to fork concurrent threads that will ingest data into the database table. For that, we need the same IP address of the endpoint where the micros, the, the service is listening. Okay, we will have two G meter processes uh, called north and west, and each will be talking threads. The, I invite you to observe the short latency of the threads uh, forked by G meter so observe the latency of the insertion. Uh, you can notice this in the column near the green button. So we are generating workload now, okay, and randomly pick a thread and see uh, the data it's generated and inserting into the table. So we will run G meter for a few seconds and then we will stop. We will stop it and uh, observe the low, very low latency of the insertion. This is the fastest way of inserting data into the Oracle database. We're using the direct path insert. And now you can see the number of rows being inserted for the few seconds that uh, uh, Gmeter has uh, uh, been uh, uh, running. So that shows you how fast uh, we can ingest. Well, I'll now sh share a link to a Docker image which has the code and so that you can run this demo yourself. Thank you very much.